Hello and welcome to NTC Reviews. Today I'm going to be talking to you about this Broen Tab Object Locator, also affectionately known as simply just the tab, that's brought to you by TrackPack. Now TrackPack developed uh, some awesome software that works on your smartphone as well as on your computer via web browser. So that software is designed to give you detailed information on anything that is affixed to this little tab. And with this little tab, you're basically limited to your imagination. You can track pets, you can track children, you can track your firearms, you can track basically anything that this is affixed to or once again is in the same container as the object that you're trying to track. The cool thing about this little tab is it works on the Helium Network, the People's Network. If you're not familiar with what the Helium Network is, it has been around and building since 2019 and it really is the People's Network because people are the ones that are controlling this network. And what ends up happening is they have these little devices that they attach to the network in their home and now it provides the service efficiently and much cheaper than other providers via this Helium Network. I picked up this tab from CalChip. They are the authorized dealer in North America. I've been testing this uh, little tab for over four months now and it's worked really, really well. Whether I'm driving my vehicle, whether I'm walking my dog, whether I'm hiking, all of this information is being tracked and captured by this little device. And it's also great when my wife is utilizing the vehicle and I'm able to log on and see exactly where the vehicle is. Uh, not that I'm trying to stalk her or anything like that, but just for safety purposes. Some of the specs on this little tab. Uh, the sensor is composed of a GNSS receive, a push button, an LED indicator, and a USB-C connector. It contains a LiPo battery that can be recharged through the USB-C connector and also a three-axis accelerometer which is optimized for different asset applications for response time and battery life. While the tab is on the move, it updates every 30 seconds, and when it's standing still, it updates every four hours, conserving battery life. And as I mentioned, it is water resistant. It has this little cover here, a little dust cover and water cover, covering up the USB-C port, adding that water resistant protection, which is ideal, uh, especially when I'm out there hiking in inclement weather, and of course, when I have this affixed to my dog. And when you receive your tab, it comes in flight mode, so it's basically shut off. Uh, you're gonna wanna go ahead and charge up the battery, and then to be able to turn it on, you're gonna hold the little power button down for 15 seconds. The light will blink, meaning that it's on, and if you reverse that, hold it down for 15 seconds again, you'll be able to turn it off, put it back into flight mode, and conserve that battery if it's not in use. As far as setting it up, that's the beauty about it. Super, super simple. All you have to do is there's a little QR code on the back. You scan it with your phone app. It onboards and basically you're ready to go, ready to utilize it. Okay, so I headed over to the Track Pack website. And since I have my tab already onboarded and have four months worth of information, it's already on here showing me the location of where my tab is. So if I were to click on it, it'll tell me exactly where it is at the current moment, that it was heard by one hotspot. And those of you that are part of the Helium uh, network and Helium community and are always asking for use cases, here's a great little feature. As you can tell here, if I were to click on this radio, it's going to tell me which uh, Helium hotspot actually provided that coverage and sent that signal in order to be able to track your tab. So uh, to me, that's an excellent use case and certainly addresses a lot of questions that people have about the Helium network. So here I rename my tab to Helder's tab. And as you pan down, there's a bunch more information. Once again, the current location of the tab. If I wanted to add any type of uh, geofence and add that geofence so I would know whenever this tab came into that location or left that location, I would actually get a push notification on my phone updating me as to that occurrence. So as you go here, you can tell there is all the history from dates and timelines. So some other features, if you look at this location, 1205 on January 20th, if I were to go to options, I can also locate and pinpoint that direction on Google Maps, making it easier for me to get to that object, uh, be it my pet, be it uh, some type of valuable, be it a vehicle, and be able to retrieve that or at least know exactly where it is 
a few other options here with the drop down menu once again your trackers if you want to go ahead and add more trackers or even more devices that are available from trackback you'd be able to go and track them here uh, setting up different alerts and seeing your alerts seeing different assets if you're creating it especially if you have a fleet that you are deploying and we don't want to be able to uh, track all of those movements uh, different groups that you could uh, create and of course your account I did have to go ahead and renew and get a subscription in order for my tab to keep working and the uh, best part about that it was forty dollars for the year for the year I've uh, paid that monthly for other devices in the past when it comes to the app, once again, available for iOS or for Android, works very similar to what I just showed you in the actual web app. And once again, upgrades seem to be coming at all times. So I'm pretty excited uh, to what the future uh, holds. I also want to pick one of these up, as I uh, mentioned earlier. These tabs are available in the United States as well as Europe. And I do have a home in Europe, spend a lot of time in Europe. So I definitely want to get my hand on a few different uh, track pack devices test them out there and uh, if everything goes well I will definitely report back and fill you in on that information so be sure to subscribe like do all that good stuff if you're interested in the information that I'm conveying and what I really like about these use cases uh, with the helium network is many times I'm trying to explain to family friends and even subscribers what this network really is and a lot of times it's difficult for me to explain that information without getting a bit too technical for the audience that I'm conveying that information to. And now when I have something like this and people are like, hey, what's this Helium network all about? I can show them how it works as opposed to trying to explain it. So for those of you involved in the Helium network and in the Helium community and are always complaining about lack of use cases and lack of IoT devices and being able to convey this information similar to what I just explained, here's a great use case that you can now show your family, friends, and instead of trying to explain it, they can see it visually. So bottom line, if you're in the market for a tracking device that is inexpensive, works really well, very intuitive, and help develop and build out this Helium network, definitely take a look at these tabs by TrackPack.